Hi, I'm Kenda, and I'm one of the founding partners of a boutique real estate brokerage here in Cabo called Finn Real Estate Group. And I am obsessed with helping people understand the real estate market here in Cabo. So I'm gonna to talk to you today about one of the most frequently asked questions I get. It has to do with the F word. And I hear this all the time. What is, what is that F word? Well, the F word in my life is the fideicomiso. Now, fideicomiso is only basically the Spanish word for a trust. And it's been around for a very long time. But the way that it started affecting you and me is in this way. The, the Mexican constitution has very clearly laid out rules that foreigners cannot buy or sell property within certain restricted zones. Now, of course, it's the most beautiful properties. It's the property that is just on the ocean and it's 50 miles inland from the coast and 100, not, excuse me, 50 kilometers inland from the coast and, and 100 kilometers from a border. So all the most beautiful property. So around the 1970s, the Mexican government started thinking like, wait a minute, I bet if we let these foreigners come buy property here, we could make a lot of money on the foreigners living here. So they decided to use this vehicle of the Fideicomiso to allow per foreigners to purchase property through this trust. Now, the trust is run by a bank and it costs about $2,000 to get yourself a new fit of So it is your property, even though it is held in a trust. And if you've worked with me in the past, you know that I've asked for your heirs. That's because the property is passed down through perpetuity to your heirs, and it is your property that is just being held in a bank. Now, you're gonna have to pay an annual fee for the bank to manage this Fideicomiso for you. And the annual fee generally runs about $550. And the cost for a brand new trust or a brand new Fideicomiso is usually around $2,000. So if you purchase a property that already has a Fideicomiso on it, which means you're purchasing it from another foreigner, you can, in some cases, just take over the trust and assume the trust and that will save you about $1,000 because it costs around $1,000 to switch it over. But you just want to make absolutely sure that you know how many years are left on that particular trust because if it's getting close to the 50-year mark, you may as well just get a new trust. So hopefully that's been really easy to understand. A Mexican trust is called a Fideicomiso. If you're a foreigner and you want to buy property in this gorgeous place, you have to have one. I have one and anybody else who has purchased property here has one. So hopefully that helps you, help you understand the F word. Next time you hear somebody ask about the F word, you'll know exactly what they're talking about. My name is Kenda. Please leave me your comments and questions in the comments below. I would love to address your question of what you don't understand about this crazy Cabo market. I understand it well, I love it, and I would love to share it with you. So please, again, leave me your comments. Like or follow me on my social media. My social media is Kenda Cabo Realty. And again, I am one of the founding partners of a boutique real estate brokerage here called Finn Real Estate. So you can look us up on finn.group and Finn Real Estate Group. So happy to help. And if there's anything I can do for you or anybody else who has a real estate question, please let me know. I'm here to help. Have a great day.